Let me show you a couple quick, simple ways to delete or reset saved game data for iOS games on your iPhone or your iPad. Some games save data in different locations, so you may have to try a couple of these different ways out, depending on the game. We'll take a look at two main methods, and then as a last resort, we'll take a look at how to delete and then reinstall the game or app if the previous ways didn't work. First, many iOS games now save their progress data inside of Game Center, which is gonna be stored inside of your iCloud account. To find this, first, open up your Settings app. Once you're inside of Settings, tap your name here at the top. Next, in the second section, you'll see iCloud. Choose this. Give it a second as your iPhone's figuring out your iCloud storage, and once it appears here at the top, choose Manage Account Storage. Now inside of here, you're going to see a list of all of the games and apps that uses your iCloud account as its storage device. If the game that you're playing and you want to reset uses Game Center and the iCloud to save your data, then it's going to be listed inside of here. For instance, in my case here, I'll scroll down until I see a game like Overland here. Choose this, and then inside of here, you'll see Delete Data from iCloud. Tap that, and then confirm again on the pop-up on the bottom. After that, any saved progress that you have stored inside of your Game Center on iCloud will then be deleted and the game will be reset. Now, this is the easiest way to reset and delete your game data, but not all games are gonna save this way. Each game or app is gonna handle data differently. For instance, if you're looking for a game inside of here and you're not finding it, then that means the game saves it elsewhere. In that case, the next option that we can look at is resetting the game data inside of the game itself. I'll go ahead and close settings, and then we'll use Skate City here as the example. Open the app, and then from the main home screen here, you should see a menu or a settings menu. Choose this, and then inside of the individual game or apps menu, usually if you scroll down to the bottom, you'll see an option like in this case here, reset progress. Again, every game and app is gonna be different, but if it does offer this feature, then more than likely it's gonna be found inside of some sort of settings menu. I can go ahead and tap reset progress here, and then again, confirm on the next window. But what happens if you've looked everywhere inside of iCloud and the game or app itself and you still can't find this? The final option that we'll look at is deleting the app completely from your iPhone and then reinstalling. To do this, head back to your home screen and then find the game or app that you want to delete. Press and hold on the app icon until the pop-up menu appears. From the pop-up menu, choose Remove App, and then on the next screen, confirm again by choosing Delete App. After you delete it from your iPhone or iPad, you'll then need to head back into the App Store where you can search and download it again. If for some reason none of these options have worked and you're trying to reset your progress on a game like Clash of Clans here, you may actually have to try a different option. The reason you aren't able to reset is because they save your data to their own servers attached to your email or whoever set up your account originally. In this case, with this game specifically, you'll need to sign up for a new account with a new email. So the same step as before, we would just delete the app from our iPhone, reinstall it, and then when you open it up again, sign up for the new account. Just make sure that you're not using the same email that you used to create the last account with. This may change in the future and they may allow you to reset your data within their servers, but for now, this is gonna be the workaround. And that's how you delete saved game data for iOS games on your iPhone or iPad. Thanks for watching.